guys, welcome back to Vince and Gigi's Super Channel G. Look how amazing these figures look. They look incredible. Look at all these ridiculous accessories all over the place. I can't wait to show you how great this unboxing was. And let me just say one thing. Uh, in case you're wondering what happened to Homer's arms or Carl's arm, stay tuned and find out. And those extra arms on there, those are smithers, but they're switchable arms. So, guys, if you're not already subscribed to our channel, please subscribe below. Hit the subscribe button and the little bell next to it so you can get notified every time we have a new video come out. And let us know which of these figures is your favorite, um, what you think about this, and where you're watching from. So, guys, why don't we go ahead and get started, right? Super Channel G. Super Channel G. All right, friends, and welcome back to Vincent Gigi's Super Channel G. This is so incredible. Look at this. This is actually a Toys R Us exclusive from yesteryear. Look at that. And been waiting for a long time to get this bad boy open. This was Series One, the very first one that was made by Playmates. This is the Simpsons Blocko figure set. And it has Homer, Marge, Lisa, Bart, Grandpa, Apu, um, Mr. Burns, Waylon, I'm sorry, Smithers, and Carl. Now it had their full name there, but I just said them as they're known on the show, right? So it has interchange character parts for multiple transformations. So you can switch their like legs and stuff and over 100 pieces. And what was interesting was when I got this, I didn't even realize because I'm like, all right, these are cool little figures right here. But... There's all these accessories that are somewhere in there that we can't see, so that'll be cool. I guess they're like somewhere over here. But I can't wait to see those, and of course, you know, rest in peace, Toys R Us. But it looks like they might make a comeback as Jeffrey's Toy Box. Who knows? As a store within a store. We'll see how that goes. So let's just take a look at the box real quick. That looks really cool. Man, look at Marge's hair. Oh, man. And then Homer looks like his head is doesn't go as high up as this makes it look, right? Because look at that. Looks like he's got a whole big old five head over here which he doesn't here so uh, this is super awesome super crazy and looks uh, it looks like we were gonna have Troy McClure Rabbi Krzysztofski Herb Powell um, Brad Goodman Fat Tony and Lionel Hutz I wonder if they ever made him I never followed up so let's see what the back says it says Welcome to Blocko Land, where all your favorite Simpsons family, friends, and Springfield citizens are recreated in their very own Blocko Land style. With 100 interchangeable character parts and multiple fun transformations, the possibilities are endless. And with more and more Blocko figures on the way, it won't be long before you can collect the entire town of Springfield and create all of its outrageous characters. Yes! So outstanding! And I'm ready to get this open, what do you say? Take a look at this. All right. So, uh, why doesn't it have Carl's last name? Has everybody else's last name? So let's get this this bad boy open and look. I don't know if I've ever seen it spelled out. Apu Nahasapino Petalon. Wow. Let's get this bad boy open and let's check it out. Oh, oh man. All right. Well. I guess those are Smithers arms because there's this coat. And what's back here? More character pieces? Cool. All right, so I guess we'll start here. Let's just get this off right here. And it looks like we just have to rip it open. So, uh, there we are. Let's get that. Let's tear this off. There we are. And it looks like this is a bag within a bag within a bag. Yeah. <laughs> you laughing at me over there? Well, look at all these little bags within this big bag. You gonna come see or what? Yeah. Okay. You notice it's both of us here, but so all these little bags were in this one big bag. Oops, I hit the thing on accident. So look, a bag for. Uh, they could have just put these together, don't you think? Yeah. They didn't need to have each one in its own little bag. No. But what do we have here? They could have just put it in that bag without putting it in bags and bags and bags. I agree, because look, what is this? A helmet? A uh, uh, hard hat, I guess? Or, or a cap? Here's two hard hats. We have a top hat. Skateboard. Where's the wheels? Interesting. And then we have right here, n number one foam finger, and it uh, looks like a turban. And then, oh, saxophone, look at this. 
I guess this fell from over here. So, man, look at all these. So let's oh, take a look. I, I thought it only came with these. That's what I thought, too, because it was blocked off like that. Look at all these accessories. All right, so here's Lisa, and she's kind of wide. Look at <laughs> Bart. Look at Marge, Homer, Grandpa, so Abe. We have Apu, Mr. Burns, this Montgomery. This looks weird. It's, look at his nose. I know, that's Charles Montgomery Burns. And we have uh, Mr. Simpson. This is uh, Smithers. And we have Carl here, so... Uh, what is this? I guess that's like an apron for Marge, uh, arms for Smithers, for his jacket, what is the cape for Homer, saxophone, we have uh, these like, what do, what do we call these? I guess like plier things that, that hold that um, uh, nuclear reactive little tube right there. We have Homer's tie, we have a sheet of cookies, what's this? Oh, it's Bartman I guess. <laughs> Wow, this is just so many accessories, just so many great things. I guess this is like a fez. This is, I have no idea, a money bag, I guess. Um, I guess that's a drink, a slingshot, a magnifying glass, uh, it's a bowling ball bag, I'm assuming. So we got quite a few accessories in here. So Bartman cape. Let's start getting these guys out. So we'll set that aside. Let's start right here with everyone's favorite. Let's start with Bart, right? I guess let's get it out of here. Put that aside. Let's take a look. Wow, look at this Bart. I wonder if his arms, man, they're nice and stiff. Hopefully they don't break since these guys are 16 years old. Oh, all right, let's see. Is the head turn? It does turn. Does it go back and forth or only turn? Only turns and it's stiff. Let's see, the legs only go back and forth. They go side to side. Well, I think they go side to side only, not really on purpose, but there we go. Look, he's got a little ear. Let's see. Wow, 2002 Fox. And the arms, they feel like they're gonna crack off. But um, this looks really awesome. Look at that. So it looks like they're not compatible with anything Lego because that wouldn't fit. So that was a cool Bart. Let's get Homer, because that would be my next favorite, right? Whoa, Marge. Look at that. Okay, so his elbows, there's no elbows to bend. Oh no, that's exactly what I was afraid of. What? What? Oh man, because they're so old, look. Oh. I'm gonna have to glue the arm, isn't that terrible? Look at that, I guess I'm not gonna be able to move the, the parts because it's just so stiff, I push it's like. Oh. <laughs> oh, I don't think that broke though, but. Oh man, I'm not gonna have some sort of like lint fuzz. Well, the hand popped out, so. I guess it's better if I don't. Ugh. Ugh, his arm's gonna break off. Let me just. I need to apply more pressure here. All right, let's see if the legs move. They look like Roblox characters. Yeah, they do. All right, so this is one arm Homer. Did I tell him I got my glasses? No, but we'll take a look at that in a minute, right? Yeah. All right, so let's put one arm Homer off. <laughs> oh man, this is horrible. They're so old that to review them and cracked off. All right, let's see who we got next. Let's do Marge. Ooh, that was a Bart mentioning. Marge, all right, so I wonder if the, yep, look at that. Turns into the Sinead O'Connor. So this is a pretty good face right here. Pop her hair on. Um, let's see, I guess if the arms move kind of on their own, uh, I'll move them a little bit, so. Otherwise we don't want to crack off like Homer's. Really, Homer's like our favorite character. Why'd that have to happen? All right, and so these legs move a little bit. Look at this. And independently, I guess it, I don't know if it moves at the waist or not, but I'm not really wanting to try because it'll break. So this looks pretty cool. Look at that. Shoes, where's the necklace? There's the necklace. That's pretty awesome. Sit her right here next to Homer. <laughs> All right, let's see Lisa. You know what? I didn't even think about it till now, but there's no Maggie. Didn't even notice. Now I did. So, uh, there we go. Let's see. So it just pops on right here. But her head is a thousand times bigger than Marge's. So this is not going to... Is it interchangeable? I guess some characters are interchangeable with the other ones. Look. Oh my <laughs> gosh. <laughs> but it's not going to interchange with Marge because the head's different. I wonder why they didn't just make them all the same like size or whatever. Let's see. Look. Because, see? Oh my gosh! Alright, so put that right over here. Let's see if this fits on Homer. No, it's too small. So, 
so much for those interchangeable parts, but let's see. There we go. Set that back over here. Let's see if we can get Lisa standing again. And then Lisa's little dress, her shoes, right? Arms. Let's see if. Uh, I don't want that other one to break. Alright, so that'll work. We'll use some crazy glue to see if we can get that arm back on. There we go. I'm gonna turn the face and not the hair because then the hair pops right off. Okay, next. We have Grandpa. Let's see. Okay. Again, careful with the arms. The head should be fine. Alright, cool. Look at his glasses. Look at his expression. Cool little legs right here. You know, I really like these. I wonder if... No, oh, he does turn at the waist. They're just so stiff after all these years. Let's see what it looks like with his fez on. He's like a Shriner guy. Look at his little hair. And just... Oh, it snaps on. Cool. That's pretty awesome. All right, that's awesome. Okay. Let's put him right here. And because of that, let's go ahead and get this Lisa. And it looks like we can put the saxophone right around her neck. Let's take that off. Let's put this, because this is pretty bendy. Look. All right, we'll put that right there. And she can play all the songs by Foreigner that she wants. So urgent. If you don't know what I'm talking about, you can look it up. <laughs> all right. Or Duran Duran, the, the solo for uh, Rio. Okay, let's see. Oh, you know what? We did do Bart, so let's, let's do the Bartman deal right here. Let's see if we can just... Oh, it fit! It fit, believe it or not. And let's get this right here. Look at this. Because this is nice and bendy right here, too. Come on. Get in there. There we are. Okay, that's awesome. Okay, maybe I can loosen the head up a little bit. There we go. Okay, let's give him this. Slingshot. Let's see how well it fits right here without cracking his arm off. That's the key. Without cracking the arm off. Uh, the hand's a little small. Okay, well it still fit good in there. Look at that. Cool. Set that right there. I'm gonna give Marge this little apron. Again, just kind of bendy so we can just, oops, go like this. See? Perfect. So that should be good right there. We'll give her a little tray of cookies. Oh no, I'm knocking stuff over again. And then I got a tape stuck on me. There we go. Look at this. I dropped something right here. Can you give it to me? I don't even see what it was. There, oh, there it is. I got it. Ugh. Okay. What is that? It's a, it's a sweater. I'll show you. It's Yeah, we'll we'll try this sweater on in a minute. Okay, let's let's do um. Carl. <laughs> Carl. His big nose. <laughs> Look at his little hair. Okay, looks like he can switch out hair with Marge. All right, let's protect the arms as we turn them. Okay, that works. The little hands move pretty good, little lobster claw hands. Let's see, moves at the waist. Oh no! All I want to do is move it at the waist. Let me see, let me see. All I want to do is move it at the waist and it's just so fragile. Oh my gosh! Two arms broken! That's dust! I guess I can glue that later. Let me... No. All right. Well, so much for doing that for Carl. Man, this was a big bummer. And I was that so is, excited to do it too. We'll that put is some... dust broken. Let's see. All right. So let's move on to Smithers. This would be so exciting if I wasn't worried about all their parts breaking off. All right. So that's Homer Simpson. Sorry, from Sector Seven G. It's pretty good. So let's move his arms up right here. Turn his little hands. It's a little better here, and obviously we know that. Should I even bother trying to turn it? Okay, don't even touch the arms at all. There we go. Let's see what it looks like here. Cool. 
Ah, there one is there. <laughs> okay, this one looks pretty good. Got this cool little hair. Let's just try to put this on. Uh, I don't know if I want to. I was gonna say, let's put this on Smithers so we don't have to worry about it because I feel like if I try to pop the arm off, it's gonna bring the whole arm off. So let's just imagine this goes on Homer or right here on Smithers and it would look really cool. The problem is uh, we have to pop the arm off to get it on there. Oh, uh, otherwise he looks pretty cool. Let's put him right here. Let's see, this Homer, let's see if we can put a tie on him at least. That looks cool. Let's see. These are easy to get out. Yeah, they are. Man, if we could have. Hey, look, there's extra. Dancing Homer right here. Yeah, there is. Except the little ball joint for the arms will break off. So that's what's breaking off. Let's see, let's see if I can. Oh no! I was hoping that I could at least turn this. I was so hoping. If I let go, is it gonna come off? Two arms! Now look at him, he looks like a pickle. Goodness gracious. You know? Uh, all right, armless Homer. And all I wanted to do was give him his little like nuclear reactor thing. All right, so here's the arm for Smithers. This would go right here. Like, so that would go good. Oh well. Let's do Mr. Jones. All right. Please don't crack off. Please. I'll only move it until it gets like tight to move. All right. So legs, waist. Obviously, I'm not looking at a whole lot of articulation because the pop off. I want look. This is interesting. I guess we can put this little like horseshoe haircut. <laughs> oh, can't get it to stay. At least this can be like interchangeable, I guess. So that's kind of cool. Look at Mr. Burns' nose. Look at his face. Look at his suit. Simpson, eh? Doesn't ring a bell. He looks really cool. And let's see, he's got a money sack here. And let's see what else. We have this, the bowling ball bag, the magnifying glass, the drink. Oh, that's what it is. This is squishy. So we'll, we'll give him the money bag. Put that right there in his hand. We'll put him over here by Smithers. And let's get a pool. And let's just pop out all these other accessories just so we can have them here. All right, let's see if we can get these to go. All right. What a bummer as far as the people that are breaking. Ooh, I almost broke that hand. All right, so this is a really cool outfit. They made from this paint. Really digging it. Look at this hair. I'm assuming it comes off. And so his head came off. <laughs> All right, let's see. I guess the hair doesn't come off unless it's just stuck on there like everything else. But nonetheless, this is probably Bart's squishy, but we'll just say it's a poo serving it. So we'll put him right here. And sorry, let me get that out of the way. And let's see what this says right here. So the Blocko figures snap on different accessories and each figure transforms into new themes. You would think so, because look, we can do this, but this doesn't work if their arms crack off. So, anyway, I was so, so, so excited about this. Let's see, top hat, there's Smithers with his sweater vest, Carl with his hat, let's see, Apu, oh, his hair does have to come off, I forgot, because wedding Apu has to put the turban on. So, anyway. Let's take a look at some of these. So I can just poke my finger through it. There we go. 
and we'll leave Mr. Burns hair on and just put that top hat. All right? Oh, look at his liver spots on his head. <laughs> That's cool. And let's take a look at this. Let's see. Which one is this one? The mascot Homer, right? Dancing Homer. Where's the one with the with the big hat? The helmet. Oh, it's Bart's helmet right here. Daredevil Bart. That's right. And there's let's see, dancing Homer, but except he doesn't have any. Let's take that. Let's put where is it? Here it is. Put his little mascot hat on. Boom. That that looks cool. And then we can put the the cape, right? Let's just force this open since it's just little plastic pieces. There we go. And he's dancing, just doesn't have any arms. So we'll put him right here. We can have... Ugh, there we go. So the accessories don't fit on everybody, remember, because they have all sorts of different heads for some reason. I don't know why Bart just so big and fat, but he is. So let's put this on Carl. Take his little hair off and put that. That looks pretty cool. Look at that. So he only has one arm. Put that over there. Let's get Bart's skateboard out. Let's see if it rolls. I guess ish. <laughs> I'll put him right here. If I can get it to go in, which it looks like maybe not. Really forced it in there and look I could barely get it that much in there. Twist, twist, twist. Whatever. Somehow it still uh kind of goes on in there ish. Okay. And then let's see this. Let's see Daredevil part. Let's take the the Bartman mask off. Put that on. Man, it's big. Look at that. Cool. And let's see these other couple accessories. Oh, this just adds insult to injury. Come on. So I guess you can put this on Homer's hand. <laughs> there we go. Too bad he can't have his hand. There we go. That looks cool. Yeah, just kind of set it there. And last but not least, we have the turban, the wedding turban. But we couldn't even get his his hair off. Look. All right. Well, whatever. So, Apu, this is yours, buddy. And his arm's gonna crack off. So, we'll just leave it like that. Put it right here. So, guys, let me know what you think. Doesn't this look pretty awesome? All these accessories, all these, uh, man, if we could only switch these outfits, but Smithers' arms are going to crack off. So, I had a great time. I hope you enjoyed it too. If you have these or you see them, I'll let you know that it's super awesome. But, be mindful of the fact that the arms could just crack off at any moment. Because, um, they've been, <laughs> they're not brand new. I wonder if when they were brand new, if the arms were so brittle because of a little joint, but... I guess we'll never know. So guys, thanks again for watching. This was super fun. They still look super amazing. So maybe this is one that's better left in the box than opening up. I really wanted to play with them like with our other figures so we could do stop motion, but it looks like it wasn't meant to be. So guys, thanks for watching and give us a big thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed to our channel, please subscribe below and we'll catch you next time on our next video. Right, Cheech? Yeah. All right. my glasses. All right. So, um, see you soon on Vincent Gigi's Super Channel G.